PicoBlock's unique web system, recessed in the walls and on the outside edges of the corner block, make attaching interior and exterior finishing materials identical to working with stud construction. The webs are located on 8-inch centers and run the full height of the block. They can be quickly located by spotting the large groove on the top edge. Interior wallboard and paneling mount just like always. Most builders prefer using screws or foam-compatible adhesive or a combination of both. If you use nails, use ring shank nails for a good grip. Where wall cabinets will be set, it's easier on the installers if you mount plywood instead of wallboard. Cut the plywood to be a bit smaller than the cabinet and screw at close intervals. Heavy fixtures like wall-mounted sinks can be securely fastened by removing the foam and mounting pressure-treated lumber. The lumber is screwed directly to the concrete core using tap cons. Exterior finishing materials, whether paneling, vinyl, or lap siding, attach just as easily. The special webs on the outside of the corner block mean that you can set fasteners right up to the edge. Again, if you choose to nail, use ring shank nails for a good grip. EcoBlock's foam is compatible with either cement or acrylic-based stucco finishes. Some systems use a fiberglass mesh, and others can be directly applied to the wall. Below grade, a damp proofing or waterproofing system is recommended, just like you would use with a conventional basement. Make sure that any products, whether spray, roll-on, or self-adhesive, are EPS foam compatible. Be sure to check with your supplier about any required protection from backfill. Some systems can be easily damaged. 